Hey everybody, David Burns here, the 60 Second Beekeeper, and today I'd like to show you how to change a winter bee kind out in the middle of the winter in uh, 60 seconds. But before I do, I want to show you this is the winter bee kind that I've gotten uh, made up here. And uh, you know, since I'm just doing this outside uh, the house here, I'm just going to kind of take some creamed honey that I that I made. And if you notice here, I'm just kind of baiting mine. You don't have to do this. But um, I, I'm just going to show you what I like to do. Just put a little bit of honey on here. And then also what I do is I take a little bit of pollen like this and just sprinkle it just like that. That's enough for me to kind of give a little bait for the bees to start on it because it's in the middle of winter. And I want them to be right on it and start eating this. So uh, we're going to go outside and film a change out. And we're going to do it in 60 seconds on a very cold winter day. It's about 31 degrees and very windy today, uh, but we're gonna I'm gonna show you how to do. It. Oh, is it cold out here and windy? But I'm gonna change out the winter be kind here. Some of you have asked me how do you do it in the, on a cold day? What if there's bees on it? So I'm just gonna walk you through it. I'm gonna open it up and then I'm just gonna take the old one off. Some of the candy gets hard if it dries out, and I'll pick that out of the way if it's there and just change it out. Here we go in three, two, one. They've completely eaten all the candy off and some has fallen down. And there's the top of the cluster. We can remove some of that if it's in the way, or you can just leave it. It's off to the edges, away from the cluster is why they didn't eat it. Take your new one like this that we've made. Put it right on top. They are about out of food, so perfect timing. Always put a brick back on top like this to hold the top down. That's how you do it in 60 seconds. Thanks for watching.